Okay, watch this and get back to me. We're gonna talk. Through deep learning, the AI understands objects and the relationship between them. So if you ask Dali to create an image of a koala riding a motorcycle, it can do that and create endless variations. You can also ask for edits, like changing a hairstyle. Just select the area and describe what you want. And it can place objects in images, understanding shadows, reflections and textures. For example, it recognizes this as water and applies reflections. An artist said the AI is better than human artists in almost every sense. Creating art in seconds in thousands of styles. He said the AI is capable of art and design quality that 99% of humans will never achieve. And he believes most professional artists are about to lose their jobs. Um, I'm genuinely scared. Like, who, who's gonna pay my bills? What about my Netflix subscription? I'm not even joking. I really am thinking, how will this apply to our kind of jobs within 10 to 15 years? Are we just gonna embrace AI and work with it? Is it gonna totally replace our jobs? What are we doing? I just wanted to make this short video today more of a conversation starter in the comment section but also for future videos. Look, it's obvious by now that AI has already started to influence a lot of industries. When you watch Tesla's new plans for the future, you're like, meh, robots will just build our cars in the future. It's gonna be the new normal. But a lot of people will lose their jobs. And the worst part is that those robots will do the job a lot of times better than those humans and more efficient and for less money. So is that what's gonna happen with the creative business as well? What about the entertainment business? If companies are gonna start using AI to create different graphics for their marketing materials, who's gonna say we're not gonna go to a stand-up comedy show featuring a Tesla bot? Yeah, you're laughing now. You know, there's a lot of videos out there covering this topic. And if you want to see the full video of what I just showed you, links in the description. Today, I just wanted to start a hopefully ongoing conversation about the creative business alone. How could something like this influence individual creators or better yet, employees in bigger companies? Yeah, you can play with this tool here and there, but what about when big companies like Nike, Coca-Cola, or you name it, what about when they are gonna use this technology? How is this gonna affect all of us? Look, I'm sure I'm not the only one asking these questions, but you can't blame me for being a bit worried about this. I am nothing close to an expert on this, and I can think of a lot of scenarios where this can be applied. Let's take the movie industry. Disney comes up with a new Star Wars movie. I hope they don't. They've shot and cut the movie, it's ready for public, now the marketing team comes in. What do they do? They make official posters and trailers. Who's gonna do that better? Or faster? And cheaper? I'm really, truly trying to think how human creativity could compete with AI. If this technology becomes affordable for middle-sized companies, your everyday graphic designer that does marketing campaigns and updates your website might lose his job. I don't know, convince me I'm wrong. And I know I'm starting to sound pessimistic, but I also know that this will not happen in the near future. But when it does, what do we do? All right, that's all from me today. This might be the last time you see me in this space. Uh, not here on YouTube, I mean here in this room. <laughs>